This kilometer-sized black hole will rip you apart, and not because of the gravity. See, this black hole is charged, but in a way, not by very much. If you took the equivalent mass of the black hole in the form of iron, the charge of the black hole would be the equivalent of stripping away a single electron for every 10 quadrillion iron atoms. But to get a black hole with an event horizon that's 2 kilometers across, the irreducible mass needs to be around 16% the mass of the sun. So even though it doesn't have a huge charge to mass ratio, it does have a lot of charge because it has a lot of mass. Around 5.7 times 10 to the 19th coulombs. That's about the amount of charge transferred in a billion billion lightning bolts. So it is a lot of charge viewed that way. But despite the mass and the charge, if you're orbiting this black hole from a million kilometers away, you'll orbit happily. The tidal forces due to gravity are minuscule. But the electric field produced by the enormous charge in the black hole at this distance is around 500 billion volts per meter. By the way, that is pretty big, but we can make bigger ones with super powerful lasers. Anyway, it turns out that that's approximately the electric field necessary to rip electrons off of hydrogen atoms. This is by a process called tunnel ionization, if you want to look it up on Wikipedia. Because electrons are negative and protons are positive, if you put a hydrogen atom in an electric field, the proton wants to go in the direction of the electric field, and the electron wants to go in the opposite direction. Of course, they also attract each other, so there's a balance. But if the electric field is strong enough, the attractive force between the proton and the electron is just not strong enough to keep the hydrogen atom intact. The end result? All of the atoms that make you up turn into plasma, and you stop being you.